The February 2010 Nagorno-Karabakh skirmish was a scattered exchange of gunfire that took place on February 18 on the line of contact dividing Azerbaijani and the Karabakh Armenian military forces. Azerbaijan accused the Armenian forces of firing on the Azerbaijani positions near Tapnarak or Yunlu, Kizilobar, Kapanli. Yusuf Kanli and Kavahili villages, as well as in uplands of Agdam Rayon with small arms fire including snipers. As a result, three Azerbaijani soldiers were killed and one wounded. The skirmish became the second deadliest ceasefire violation since 1994, after the 2008 Mardakit skirmishes. The skirmish the skirmish embraced two regions in Nagorno-Karabakh and one region out of it. Azerbaijani sources claim that on 1300 local time the Karabakh Armenian military fired from Talish towards the Azerbaijani positions in Tap, Narak or Yunlu. Accordingly, at 1500 Armenian troops allegedly opened fire from Agdam Rayon, killing one Azeri soldier. After some time the shooting achieved a large-scale character and continued until evening. According to Azerbaijani side, the Karabakh Armenian troops withdrew with losses. Casualties Following the skirmish the Azerbaijani Defense Ministry announced the names of those killed. Private Sayil Mamadov, Corporal Royal Farijov, Private Davud Rustamov, Private Elvar Nadigothalov was wounded. Although the Azerbaijani Ministry of Defense estimated Armenian casualties to be not less than ours. Armenian military spokesman Senor Hazration denied that the Armenian side had sustained any casualties. International reaction Iran on February 19th Iranian ambassador in Armenia Said Ali Sagayan said at a press conference in Yerevan, Iran shares a common border with Karabakh, and therefore we surely have our own considerations and views about the composition of a peacekeeping force that might be deployed in the conflict zone. Sagayan, however, did not clarify what he meant by Iran and Karabakh share a common border.